Listen to the poem, Don't Make Me Go. As you listen, think about the language features of the poem. Does it repeat any words? Are any similes or metaphors in the poem? Is alliteration used? Are there any rhyming patterns? Think about the structural features of the poem. How has it been set out? Is it in verses? Does each line end with the same punctuation? Does every line begin with a capital letter? When you listen, think about who is talking in the poem and what it is about. Don't make me go. I don't think I can go to school today, moaned a groaning Jimmy Bob. My stomach hurts, my hand is red, I won't be able to do my job. There is nothing that I need to do, he pleaded to his patient mum. So don't make me go to school, I have awful grumblings in my tum. I need to stay at home today, so please don't make me go. I can help you with your work, if you don't tell me no. I can't find my school book, he wailed, a sad look in his eye. My teacher will be mad with me, he implored with a desperate cry. The school bus has already left. I definitely can't go now. I might as well stay at home. His mum raised a single eyebrow. It's raining. I'm tired. I'll miss you. The excuses came thick and fast. I'm sure I've got knits stuck in my hair. Nobody wants them to be passed. Well, I would make you go, said his mum, looking kindly down at her son. But school is closed today. It's Saturday, so let's have some fun. Now that you have heard the poem in full, look at it in smaller sections and discuss the questions. What is the title of the poem? What does the line, moaned a groaning Jimmy Bob, tell you about how Jimmy Bob was feeling? Which lines of the verse rhyme? Why do you think the poet described Jimmy Bob's mum as patient? Which are the words that rhyme in this verse? Do you think his mum will let him stay home? Explain your answer. What word does the poet use to say Jimmy Bob begged his mum to stay at home? Is there a good adjective in this verse? How does the poet use punctuation to show special importance? Why do you think Jimmy Bob's mum raised her eyebrow? How do you think his mum is feeling? Why do you think the first line includes three statements? What does the phrase thick and fast mean? Is the ending of the poem what you expected? Do you think the title was a good title for this poem? Discuss and describe the poem. Did you like the poem? Did the structure of the poem change at all? How does the poem make you feel? What effect did the poem have on you?